But since the crisis, uh, both of us have felt that the United States needs a much heavier dose of entrepreneurship. Uh, and a few factoids bear this out. Uh, since, 19, uh, since 2008, the number of startups per year has fallen from about 600,000 a year to where, uh, where it used to be for about a decade to about 400,000 now. That's factoid number one. Factoid number two is that the survival, the five-year survival rate of new firms uh, is down uh, compared to the historical average. It used to be about 50 percent. Now we're in about the 45 percent range. And third, there has been a secular decline in the number of new jobs created per startup. Uh, this dates actually since the internet bust of 2001, and it's been going down, largely uh, for reasons independent of the recession, in my personal view. Uh, I think uh, it's because of outsourcing, the cheapness of the cloud, and IT, and all that. You don't need uh, to hire a lot of people. You can rent them. So in any event, these three forces in combination mean that if we want to get job recovery back to anywhere close to the kinds of two to 300,000 a month pace that we need in order to make a significant dent on the unemployment rate without having a drop in the labor force uh, participation rate that uh, Governor Romney talked about uh, so much in the debate, uh, we're not going to get back to those halcyon days unless uh, we have uh, another entrepreneurial revolution, and not just one, but one that's sustained through time. 